<laughs> Galaxies of Popcorn Shadow, Season 2, Episode 46. Everyone, into the cave! They're coming right for us. It's coming right for us. Alright, so after this, I think we're gonna do a couple of sub episodes just to mix it up. And I keep checking for Dragon Ball Kai on this thing. I pay for this freaking thing, and it, it just... It matter? shows up, but it doesn't work right. I don't know, it's weird. Those four Dragon Balls we saw all gathered in the same place. Whoever those guys are, they have the Dragon Balls with them! This is bad. Real bad. Go on! <laughs> that was dramatic, K-9. <laughs> Not just a little bit either, I mean a lot. Not to mention all those other guys he had with him. What about me? You can't just leave me here all by myself. Oh my god, you're so annoying. Remember, Gohan, keep your power level pushed down so they don't spot us coming. The boys. Be safe, you guys. I can't make it home without you. Oh my god, she's so selfish. <laughs> I'm coming, I'm coming. Keep your pants on. Oh, Get it? I'm afraid you're going to have to rest up for at least a little while yet. Goku, big news from Namek. No way! Vegeta? I mean, someone even more powerful than Vegeta? A gift from Korin. One bag of fresh pick Sinzu bean. Back into the uniform King Kai gave me. There. Now no time to waste. Off to planet Namek. He's just going? Goku in action. Bulma's dad came to visit not too long ago. I asked him if he could build another spaceship. What is this contact? Come on. I remembered the ship I came in here as a baby was never destroyed. All right, makes sense. Good makes thinking. sense. See you guys. So the thirst for battle is in his blood. Character. Did they just toss a pole in the foreground of the same animation. Oh, this place looks nice. Oh, I remember her. Goodness, no, not even close. But he's still working. <laughs> Not even close. Handsome, just like oh, that's a brand new voice, right? We haven't He's seen her okay. yet. So this is my ship, huh? I didn't think it would be so big. I'll be right back with some refreshments, okay? Oh, sure. Thank you. This, it's incredible. That's a nice spaceship. Who knows? Anyway, I installed everything you asked for, even the training stuff. You can set it to go anywhere from double to 100 times the Earth's natural gravity. Holy hell. <laughs> She's ready now. Anywhere in the universe you want to go. Uh, what? What? Isn't finished. I haven't installed the cappuccino machine yet. What? Are you jokes? But there's no time. I'm in a big hurry. Six days? Great. That means I can definitely get there in time to help them out. It's that guy. You mean that spaceship? On his way. On his way to planet Namek. We're close. They nice parallax effect. Since when were K9 and Gohan 20k? Take a look at what those guys have tucked under their arms. It's the Dragon Balls. Does your scouter indicate something? I don't know. They spot us. We're as good as dead. Let's get moving. Believe me, you don't want to make me come in after you. They look just like Piccolo. Pretty lonely too. Do you have like music or something? Does that thing get Spotify? I trained at ten times gravity on King Kai's planet, so I should probably start higher than that. Twenty. Should have tried eleven. The shadow of Frieza looms large. Next time on Dragon Ball Z. There it is. Yeah. So we have new threat, well established. They're all after the same thing. But we've got the conflict between two of the antagonists. We got Vegeta going up against Frieza, which is mixing up the whole uh, dynamic in the first place. And we already fought Vegeta. So they were able to carry that character along, which is really nice. We have dumped Bulma off in a cave somewhere, so that is a huge plus. And K9 being kind of a, I don't know, a shepherd for Gohan you know, and furthering his training is a really nice thing between those two. But it's all super serious now, and uh, it wasn't as bad as Contact. <laughs> like, oh, we just, we built two, don't worry about it. <laughs> because uh, it was based on his, you know, original ship, so that's nice. But yeah, so we are going to do the sub for the next couple of episodes. I would like to, when it comes to the most monumentous conflicts, even though I like the look of 
the dub, did I say dub or I can't remember. But even though I like the look of the dub more and it's kind of easier to go through without having to read all the subtitles and a little easier to edit, looks a little nicer. Uh, Still, it's kind of nice to have the sub for bigger conflicts and things that might have significant character or story moments, because it seems like it might be more accurate. <laughs> and I think it's just, you know, respectful to the creators of the show, since uh, that's how it was originally created. But whatever the case, uh, yeah, so we're going on to the next one. See what happens with Frieza and Vegeta and Jigglypuff and Zelda and the boys. Thank you.